Yo, 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 yo. How you guys doing today? Wobble, what's up, buddy? Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. Easy money, boys. Silver common method is back, baby. This cut says class for some I've been grinding for two consecutive hours this year. I know, isn't it great? Of course, they drop it when stuff isn't in packs, but uh, we kind of had a feeling we were going to get something like this. I personally love this stuff. I know you do, too. What's up, bud? Welcome, everyone. We'll be live for about an hour 15 today. Don't we all? Yeah, we'll have the video up tomorrow, boys. Um, usually on Friday content, I can't record um, as easily. Um, so we'll have it go up as the Saturday video. But in the meantime, if you look at the pinned comment, that is our method on how we're doing these. At least the campaign pack is there, repeatable five times. Oh yeah, definitely. You can do basically whatever you want with the grind. They even, was the Cruyff out or is that expected to come? I don't remember seeing it, unless I'm just blind. Supposedly, you can potentially get the objective card. Lizard, what's up, buddy? Supposedly, guys, you can get the objective card if you play with a friend. And he has the card. And you get this stuff done. Craft release today. Feels like a Saturday. It does feel like a weekend, low key. All right, so what we're gonna do? We're gonna take all the commons. We're gonna keep the rares. We're gonna build the uh, the icon pack silver rare sections, or the icon player silver rare sections. So you can get a couple of tradable gold rares as well. Yeah, the five gold commons is going to be unbelievable for this. One, you're going to get so many. We'll break this into three parts. So with this, there's three benefits of these. Uh, one of the benefits is it's almost double what you're used to. Instead of three, you get five, uh, which that's a huge upgrade. Um, second benefit is you can pack team of the weeks. So instead of buying a team of the week, which is going to be going up in price right now, um, you can get it untradeable, which is going to be huge. If they have a base common. And then third, you're going to get a ton of 80, 81, 82 rated cards um, that are gold common. That rating wise, you can put into the, uh, I'm blanking on the name, um, into the uh, SBCs that require like an 82 rated team. You won't need a gold rare 82 for that. All right, we got the 10 coins energizer pack. Let's see if this is any good. A 
I'll take a board. Take it. Time for an 82 times 20. Yeah, if you guys have any 82 times 20 or campaign share plays, feel free to send them over, boys. Junior, what's up, buddy? Got my comeback after a month in Pack Gino last night. Sold for 1.42 million. And then EA dropped this content today. You'll love it. Dude, it's kind of a W out of nowhere for me, eh? It's crazy how that works. My head's spinning with these SVCs. What, I, like what to do with them? We'll have a video out tomorrow. In the meantime, you can look at the pinned comment if you need help. You're going to see two videos from me this week, for sure. You're going to get one tomorrow, aka Saturday, if it's already tomorrow for you. I don't know what time it is where people are. Um, on how to grind the 75 times 5 into everything else. But we are also going to make a silver common method. Because, if you guys don't know, um, a lot of you know us for our silver libs. If you don't know us from silver commons, we made millions in past FIFA so off of silver commons. All right, A2 plus times 20. Some people are going to want to save these. Um, it's really your call. I'm using it so I don't have to buy fodder for um, all the SBCs that come out this week that we're doing. Alibi 85. Yeah, the 83 double upgrades is still too. And again, if you guys don't care about the... Uh, if you don't care about the uh, the player SVCs that come out, you don't think you're going to do a lot of them, um, or you want to just save like the 82 times 20 packs or the 83 doubles, those are going to be really nice for the next promo. Not even a Liverpool player. Yeah, what are the prices of Liverpool players? I'm assuming they're crazy. No one can complain about the 82 times 20 because it's so cheap. There'll be people who are upset that they have to open it now with really, quote unquote, nothing in packs. But, I mean, that's always going to be the case. Five K. Weird. Okay. Yo, know, if you guys do enjoy the stream today, make sure you guys smack the like button. Let's see if we can get the ten likes right now. We got ten people in here. How's everyone doing? My plan is to do the Diaz. I have one game on him done. I'm gonna do the other four off stream. So we should have the eighty eight by the stream tomorrow. Um but if it's something you can do, like just get done. I'm in the same amount of games each time. Um, five each day. I should be able to do each one. Unless they do like a crazy price on the SBC. Which I don't see personally happening. But who knows. Twenty four seconds. Until our preview packs back as well. Free 91 Ederson and 90 Grealish you can't complain with. Yeah, those look really nice. I like how you can see the stats and the rating and everything before you can even do the card. I personally love that. through Scott for Diaz is good. If they keep doing it like that, I'll have no issues with it, personally. Best content we got this year? Dude, anytime we get these um, 75 times 5s, I love them. They made it a little bit more difficult this time, but it's 100% still grindable.
Alright, let's make some more upgrades. Why is there no St. Patrick's Day content like they used to have? I don't know, man. It pisses me off. St. Patty's Day stuff used to be my some of my favorite stuff on FIFA. One, because we'd always get a McGeady each year, which supposedly we're still getting a McGeady. Um, yeah, it was something I always look forward to. Now I don't know whether or not we're actually going to get him, man. It's a little disappointing if you ask me. EA have juicy SVCs. Yeah, anytime cards aren't in packs, they usually seem crazy. Watch me accidentally put <laughs> Ross Stewart in. I would never forgive myself. Got today off work because of St. Patrick's Day and watching the dairy match and watching Mumbo and drinking beer. This day's been good. Hey, glad to hear that, mate. Yeah, tonight we'll only be live for about an hour 15. Um, I got dinner plans with some friends doing a fish Friday. Uh, but tomorrow, my plan is to stream a crap ton tomorrow. So that should be fun. We'll be live after the Sunderland game, which I believe should be a little before new content. So I'll be able to get a workout in in the morning. Watch a bunch of football early. Campaign pack now? Send it over. Um, is the party still there or do I need another invite? Uh, Daniel, I don't know what you're saying, buddy. Uh, best footballers SBC? I mean, we've only had one so far. Unless you're talking about the objectives. Where you can see what the next objectives are going to be. I think the Ederson looks insane. For those of you who don't have a consistent goalie. Parcel there. All right. To the campaign pick sir tell me how to grind pin video or pin comment buddy means our day will come the day will come i like that yeah, if you guys are wondering how to grind the 75 plus times fives, we're going to have a video out tomorrow, aka Saturday. But for now, uh, what we're doing is the pinned comment if you need help. Right now, you can pick silver commons up for even cheaper, 150. So I'm flipping those, doubling my coins. Um, and then we're using the ones in our club uh, to make the um, silver upgrades. You doing BPM right now? Nope. I'm skipping BPM altogether. Oh, it's a pack, not a pick. My bad. Come on. What is it? Tremel. Tremel. Nice. By nice. <laughs> I mean, unlucky. All right. It's going to kick me each time, isn't it? Blue share playing about 30 minutes or so. Okay. I'm surprised it didn't kick me that time. That was weird. All 
All right, one more round of bidding, and then we'll pick up more silver commons. We'll get into the upgrades. What are the requirements for the campaign back, boys? Does anyone know? Oh, there we go. That was weird. Surprise, let me bid. Let's take a look. For the campaign pack, we need... An 83 squad and an 82. Okay. Easy. Easy, yes. Right, let's do a couple more bids. What I might do instead. I was saying how I would flip the uh, the silver commons for double the ones we aren't using. If I can consistently bid on gold common or gold libs without much competition, I might just make like 400 coins per card here. And then just mass bid on the silver commons and not even necessarily flip those just use them because what are gold commons right now gold commons are like 550 right so it's going to be way cheaper even if you can't pick them up for 150 if you pick them up for 200 it's going to be way cheaper to do the uh the gold commons from the premium silver upgrade than it would be to buy them off the market plus not to mention your opportunity to get um informs and 82s so it's a win-win long time no see akra welcome back buddy how you been dude carlos Happy Friday, dudes. What plans you guys got going on this weekend? Was about to say the same. I still got about 50k of silvers in the club. Right now, you can pick them up for 150. Easy, easy coins. Boys, speaking about coins, you might wonder why our coins are quote unquote so low. I'm going to put you on something. So we are doing a, not like a stream series or not a uh, video series, but a very kind of chill work from nothing to a million coins again. Uh, I went basically all the way down close to zero. I've been doing silver um, lib flipping today and some gold lib flipping today. The reason why we're so low is I officially got to 5k shadows so my plan is i want to trade slash grind to one mil coins again um and what we'll do is anytime we see shadows still under a thousand we'll buy more after we get to a million plus we'll just keep doing that over and over we picked up a ton today for cheap the amount of 150 open bids was wild got a bunch for under 800 on open bid so we'll keep doing that over and over and over. Shouser 750, you can pick them up for even cheaper on open bed. It's beautiful. I've been 82 times 20 to open here. Uh, feel free to send a share play, buddy. Oh, you can't. You're not PlayStation. So best way to do it is the silver upgrades in the commons. I would say so. It's cheaper than the uh, gold commons right now by a long shot. Oh, you do have places. I forgot. <laughs> yeah, send it when you're ready, buddy. Completely forgot you got one now. Just finish your midterms. Nice. How did those go? I don't know how to do it. You send me a uh, PlayStation party invite. I join your party and then you 
Select the share play. I miss y'all for real, for real. We miss you too, buddy. Alright, let's put a couple in. We need to get rid of some of this stuff. We don't need to worry about Cruyff right now. Do the 89 plus icon here in a bit. Or we'll do it this weekend, I meant not here in a bit. We won't do it today. You see where it says start share screen? Or start share play? If you're just going to open it yourself, just hit start share screen. Can you tell me a trading tip right now? No scope. I'm going to do you one better, buddy. I'm going to link you our trading playlist if you want to see all the videos that have made us millions of coins this year. The one I'd recommend more than anything right now is the gold lib method, which is also the third link in the description. If you go to the description, you'll see gold lib method. Click that video. Easy coins. All right, here we go. He's got himself in 82 times 20, he said. Jumbo Gold Pack OP. Yes, sir. Uh, why do you have so little coins? We got a crap ton more shadows. And we're doing a road to a million again. Zero to a million. Or not zero. Like 5,000 to a million. That wasn't that good. Can you tell me some lip players? No scope. I gave you the video. With that video, you can find 50 to 75 different combinations, buddy. So I gave you more than one. Good one. Nice. All right, we're going to do from the lowest rated and the highest rated ones will uh, we'll keep for the uh, campaign. Are these 75 plus players tradable or untradable? Tradable, okay. That's sick. That could come in handy. Uh, why are Liverpool players so rare in the 82 times 20? Other days I'll be packing my team frequently. It'd be like that, man. Yeah, that, uh, once you complete one of the sections, it looks like it's tradable. That's a W in my opinion. All right, so what we'll do with the rares, got a couple different thoughts running through my head. First one's going to be just to, uh, buy them out and then use the untradeable ones the next run through. You'll have most of them. We could also do lib bidding as well. Gold lib on the lower rated ones. Made 15k off those 75 plus tradable packs. Dude, the amount of boards and walkouts we're going to get at points is going to be crazy. I'm curious to see how many people 
if you just lazy listed those, would buy gold rares for higher than they're going for? I feel like quite a few would. Uh, should I start some brother or do the icon pack? Uh, if you want a chance at something potentially either really good or really bad, do the icon first. Uh, that way, if you end up packing Zembrata, you don't have to do his SBC. Um, but Zembrata is going to be out for a long time, so I would do the the chance at a good icon first. Because you are, are already know that the uh, Zembrata is going to be there for sure. Same with the Cruyff. Uh, save fodder for Mbappe or Cruyff. Whoever you want more in your team, boys. All right, here's our first 75 times 5. Well, uh, if it doesn't go for more than 700, we'll just uh, put them right back in instead of quick selling for the tradable 75. Who will be more meta? I mean, Mbappe is pretty much the most meta card in the game, I would argue. Uh, and you don't need a full caps, buddy. You can type normally. I don't know if your caps lock is on or something, but... See, now with the uh, 82s, you can sell those. Yeah, do both of them. You can grind both of them, buddy. Honestly. You'll be able to get a ton of fodder this week. All right, Dela Cruz we can put back in. Uh, please read, explain why people get mad at caps. Caps is like screaming in chat. If that makes sense. It's also seen as like spammy as well. I never saw it that way. Uh, well, that's the way we see it. How much are 82 selling at? I just sold one for, I think, 1.6. I believe. I do declare. But each one's different. Um, if you look at Footbin, it'll tell you cheapest by rating. If they're running out of players, what's your next step? League SBCs? Uh, I would never run out of players this way. The way I'm grinding currently, I would never run out of coins. I'd never run out of players. Because we're constantly picking up more and selling more. Hola, mate. ¿Cómo estás? Sí, sí. ¿Y tú? Like, I know it means screaming, but I it don't matter if you know people are screaming. So, the issue is, when you have people, most people, when it's full caps, they're spamming it in chat. It's not even just, like, a one-time thing. But if everyone starts using full caps, um, it becomes really annoying in chat. It's just the thing. I don't think I'm crazy for thinking it. If you go into literally anyone's stream and you're full capsing. You'll get kind of the same. 
response. Uh, but you can do League SVCs if you want, buddy. I'm personally not right now. You doing the bronze and silver upgrade? No, I'm doing just the silver. No bronze pack method for me. You can. Uh, I just prefer to not. Timmy, thank you for the sub, buddy. Bought 90 Benteke's at 16K. Could see some nice profit. GG, man. At least the board. We'll take that. Get the Bruyne out of the 83 double. Nice. Take 3.6. That pays for the next one, boys. There we go. Yeah, if you guys are wondering where the How to Grind video is for this SBC, it is coming out tomorrow, a.k.a. Saturday, um, if it's not uh, Friday for you right now. Um, but in the meantime, the pinned comment is how I'm doing them, if you're wondering. I'll give a quick spiel real quick, but the pinned comment is the way. So what I'm doing is I'm mass bidding on silver commons. Right now, you can win them for 150 on bid, and not every single one. But a lot of them, you can lazy list for 300 and get a lot to sell within the hour. I'm not talking just one card. It'd have to be quite a few. But even if you don't want to sell for that, you sell it for 250 you make 100 coins per card. If you don't care about profit or you'd rather get profit in a different way, Gold Libs, I'm making about 400 coins on some players right now per card. Easy coins to flip in the meantime. Then I'm just taking the Silver Commons that I win for 150 I chuck them into the... Um, premium silver upgrade because you get five gold common players. You could potentially get 82s. You could get some 83s. You could get some boards or not boards. You could get some uh, informs. Well, technically, you could get boards and walkouts if the informs have a base common. Um, but then we put those high raid players into the campaign pack and then we put the low raid ones into the 75 times five. We're just doing that over and over. Uh, hopefully I answered it, Femi. Dude, I love the tradable 75s. You know what it kind of reminds me of a little bit? It was a couple years ago, it would have been. We had a uh, an SVC where you had to put in a bronze card, a silver card, and a gold card. And you got a tradable card... That could potentially be anything. Does anyone remember that? The SVC I'm thinking about? Reminds me of Summer Heat. Next 82 times 20 is ready. Carlos, don't open. Why shouldn't he open it, Akram? The whole point of him doing the share play is to open it. If you're going to say save it until cards are out in packs, that's not what he's doing. Thus, it would be pointless for him to do that. If his goal is to get fodder for the SBCs coming out this week and to do the campaign packs. The tradable 75s are insane. Yep, anytime you get a basically a board plus, it's paying for the next one too. All right, you didn't send the share play, Carlos. Or I'm not seeing it. Oh, never mind. You must have. That was weird. It didn't pop up. All right, here we go. My bad, buddy. Yes, I know what you're on about. It was FIFA 19. It was so OP because I... That was when I did bronze pack method heavy. So I would literally just do bronze pack method into that. We got so many coins made off of it. 85. Let's go. There's an objective for each game you won. You got a double uh, player pack in FIFA 19. Oh, that wasn't even the pack. That was the tradable one. Nice. All 
Robertson. Back when BPM was efficient. Double walkout. What are the dupes? Yo, welcome, guys. If you just got here, we are opening your guys' 82 times 20s and campaign packs through SharePlay if you want to send them over. Exclamation mark PSN in chat. We're doing our own as well. Um, so if you are enjoying the stream, feel free to smack the like button. Subscribe if you're new. Uh, we have about 45 minutes until I have to head out. Just a uh, heads up for those of you either making content for us or uh, wanting to know how long we'll be here for. Two eighty threes or higher for eleven commons, eleven rares is great, especially through the league SBC. FIFA twenty was the only game I didn't play, and of course it was the FIFA. Um, we all got off school because of COVID. Let me do the final one. Save the 82 times 20 or save? Uh, you gave the same answer, man. You mean open? Uh, depends on what your goal is. If you're trying to grind Croy for any other SBC right now, for the daily player SBCs that you'll need, open. Um, I kind of think it's pointless to save, in my opinion. There's so much you can grind right now. I get the want to save until there's quote unquote things in packs, but I'm telling you, it's going to be such an efficient grind this week. You'll be surprised at how much stuff you'll be able to get done. Things not looking good for Derry. Their best center back pulled his hamstring last week. Ooh. Do they need me to fill in? Show my fodder. Uh, we just started, but I can. Uh, if I show you mine, you got to show me yours. That's how it works. Dude, quarantine was a fantastic time. Anyone who says quarantine was awful, I want to hear what your kind of experience was. Um, obviously, COVID and everything sucked. But in terms of like gaming... And being able to like chill. It was my senior year of college. So for me, all my classes kind of ended early. It was during the two week Minecraft phase as well. So I played a lot of Minecraft. They got back into FIFA during quarantine. We started making videos and streams again. Now, man, you'll be their left back. Crucial free kick taker. I'm a bit of an introvert. Yeah, if people are introverts, love quarantine. I, I'm both. I'm an introvert and an extrovert. Like tonight, I'm going to be extremely extroverted. Then when I get home, I'm not going to speak to a, a soul. Seems like I can only do two. Is it two? I, I could have thought it was three, too. I guess I'm wrong as well. Beast, what's up, buddy? Welcome, guys. All right, so what's this? 84 team, then 83 for that one, okay. Where is the campaign? Give me team of the week for that one, and then 284s for that one. Do we have a team of the week yet? We got two. Here's our fodder for those of you asking.
And then two, another thing to mention, the tradable packs in all these different grinding ones as well. We talked about the 75 um, plus player that you get in the 75 plus times five. The small gold players pack, this could be solid as well. Because you're getting one gold rare each time and then five commons, which go for what, 550 to 600? How much are 81s? They have value to them. Maybe 700 within the hour. I'll just uh, keep that one. Uh, grind for foot birthday promo is real right now. Uh, wish for another quarantine, but no virus or disease. Also read last. You could technically do your own quarantine whenever you wanted, but it's just called locking yourself into your house. It's crazy how we're closer to 2030 uh, than to 2020. Are, are you joke? Is that supposed to be a joke or are you serious, buddy? If you're serious, explain your... Explain yourself. Seven minutes of added time. Both of the halves of the game. Hope that I'm hoping it was a joke too. Just, just making sure, buddy. <laughs> One game away from the 88 DS is 86 is insane. Also, zero was 2023 years ago. Hey, we got a city card. We're getting there. So, guys, something to keep in mind. Look at the price of Liverpool cards. If you think the same thing is going to be required for each of the next objective players slash SBC players, it might not be a bad idea if you think a lot of people want, like, Ederson or something, since he's the furthest out, it looks like, to potentially pick up... Um, decently rated city players that aren't too expensive that a kanji for 1k if it goes to like three to 5k like a lot of these liverpool ones are you could make quite a bit of money yeah isn't there's like some thing happened and that was in birds and now it's like transmissible to people too great man beautiful Like, we didn't already have enough problems going on. Yeah, boys. So, every time you run through, you get two tradable 75 plus players. If they're crap, you put them back in. Which means you just need five more. Which you basically get five every time you do the 75 plus times five. Unless you get something decent. Which you'll occasionally get the board to walk out. Which then you would use for the other stuff. But then you throw the others back in. So you need to actually buy very little cards. Do the mixed campaign SBC. People are getting walkouts. That's literally what we're crafting right now, buddy. Should I buy loads of bronzes to make these silver upgrades? Why would you... Why would you buy loads of bronzes when you could just buy loads of silvers for the same price, mate? And skip the bronze completely. I guess I don't understand your logic. You can pick up silver commons for 150 on bid. Times that by 11. That's the price of five common golds. If you try to buy common golds off the market, they're going to be infinitely more than that. But if you're buying bronzes for 150, that you just waste the money at that point. <laughs> Actually, you know what? The bronze back method people would love you. Do that. 
buy all their bronze cards that they're listing up. Because everyone's spamming BPM. Do we not have... Oh my gosh, we don't have a second 84. Should I grind the 83 times 2 before the 75 times 5? Should you grind the 83 times 2 before the 75 times 5? Um, if your goal is to do all of them each day, just make sure you get them done before the new day. If that's your goal. I honestly completely forgot about these for a second. Not going to lie. I completely forgot about these for a second. Thank you for reminding me. What's the best SBC for fodder? Um, I would say the, uh, all of them, 75 times five is going to be really nice, but the 83 times two is going to be nice as well. So is the 82 times 20. You only get two a day of the 82 times 20. So you could use the 75 times five and the 83 times two to craft it. Then once you're done with them, wait till the next day. All right. We need one more 84 boys. And we have the campaign pack ready to go. A3 times two is class in my opinion. We're gonna we're gonna do that right now to get our 84, hopefully. Watch us get two 83s. Are you going to do both the 82 times 20? Yep. We won't be able to get to everything on stream, but my plan is to finish everything tonight that I can. And tomorrow we're going to do a extremely large grind. So now I'm debating what SBCs I want to uh, focus on for players. Like, do I want to do the Cruyff right now? Do I want to do Zebrata? Do I just want to do all the daily stuff and not worry about the rest? Do I want to do um, every one of these... Um, beast cards that are coming out. Realistically, you do BPM into silver, into gold, into 75, times 5, into the 83 doubles. Realistically, you don't need to do BPM at all. I don't know who he needs to hear this. This year, specifically. This is coming from someone who loves BPM and would do it for hours a day in past FIFAs. BPM is not needed. You can skip that step entirely. Save hours a day of grinding if you're going hard on BPM, as a lot of people do, and get the same, if not better, result by bidding on silver commons. That's my personal opinion. Because if your goal is to start with BPM and build all your way up, and you can't, um, you want to skip steps, and you're thinking, oh, let me go right to gold commons. Gold commons have infinite competition right now. If you're trying to flip them for profit, there's not much room. But silver commons, on the other hand, are this beautiful thing where right now you can make 100 coins minimum per card. Very little competition at the moment. And you can double your coins on a lot of them if you know what leagues to look at. Plus, you can use these, put them into the upgrade, which we have the times five gold common, which is going to be way cheaper to do this than buying the, uh, the uh, gold commons for the SBC. And it's way cheaper than BPM, low key. You can only do the 83 times 2 20 times? Yes. A day. I, You say only. I don't think everyone's going to be able to do it 20 times a day. Good evening, bud. How are you? Class matches last night? Dude, if you guys missed it, Dante beat me. Both times. And both were really close. We're both last minute goals as well. But you guys would have missed the second one because for some reason, OBS ended the stream. Like, I was still in the game just fine. Both are connected to Ethernet, so it wasn't like the Ethernet went down. It was one of those weird moments where it just disconnected. I have 150k. How much should I invest into silvers? Um, I would just bid 150 into them. Um, I wouldn't even... Honestly, don't even use the silvers as a trading method. You can. You'll be waiting. 
if you're trying to get the most out of them i would do the gold lib method boys we're making 400 coins per card right now and there's a ton of cards out there that you can make similar if not more profit on i'd highly recommend looking at the video in the description if you haven't watched it already i'm doing that kind of to pay for the cards All right, let's make one more and then we'll do the uh, 83 times two. Uh, does that make sense? Uh, Cleds, and if you don't know what video I'm talking about, it's the third link in the description. Both are last minute goals. The first match was 90th and uh, Kakak goal. The second match was the 120th winner from El Orion. Dude, and I, I can't remember which one it was, if it was the first or second game. But one of them, I had a like almost a last minute chance that either I completely missed or you saved or my player didn't do something. I can't remember. All I know is there's one play where Mbappe would have been in. Oh yeah, I remember. I played a ball to Mbappe. He was in past your whole back line and it didn't register to Mbappe as my player. It registered to like Zidane on the far side or something. So instead of me selecting Mbappe... It selected Zidane, and Mbappe just completely let the ball hit him or run past him. And it ended the chance then and there. Gotta love it. Love how EA had no good content for Team of the Year and then dropped some amazing. Okay, let's be honest though. Let's be honest. Okay. I, I'm gonna say something. I don't know if this is controversial or not. But at least in my head, it makes sense. I'm curious if you guys agree or disagree with what I'm about to say. If EA gave us what they gave us today in terms of grindable menu content during any promo when there is actual players and packs, right? Team of the year, maybe team of the season down the line, um, put birthday if we end up getting it. Any of these promos. What would be the point of people ever buying FIFA packs if the grind is as good as it is today? There's no need for them to. You could get a lot of the stuff packed through this endless grind. The reason why they're giving us this endless grind right now is because nothing's really in packs. They want to give you something to grind the menus. They want you to feel like they put out good content. They want you to be happy with them. But if we got something like this when stuff's actually in packs... There, there would be no reason for people to really buy FIFA points. Everyone would be packing stuff. Um, so do silver upgrade into the 83 times two and then the 82 times 20. Yep. We'll be making a video tomorrow, AKA Saturday um, on the full process of the grind, but it's what I'm doing right now is basically laid out in the pin message, uh, but for even cheaper than the pin message. Did I open the 10 coin pack? Yes. All right, I don't know how many gold rares I have. Let me, uh, let me bid on a couple quick. Actually, you know what? We'll do libs instead. That's still at the 89 card. Uh, worth investing in case they pull off a win against United. Plus, 89s will probably go up. I will campaign back in five minutes. Sounds good. I'll be gone in 20 minutes. The stream will be closed down in 20 minutes. Plus, on the second match, it was weird when the stream ended. I had no idea what was happening. We paused it so many times. Yeah, I used up all my pauses, so I couldn't make the subs I needed. I was pissed. Do we stop grinding League SBCs for now? Uh, you can and you can't. It's up to you. I don't think, personally, you need League SBCs. Gold libs are cheaper, so the SBC is cheaper uh, as a whole from what the gold libs prices were before. Um, in my opinion, I just flip the gold libs and make a lot of coins off of them. Specifically, the uh, ones that usually have a lot of 
value to them. Um, that would be my take. There's enough menu content to keep us busy. I stopped grinding League SPCs a long time ago. Hope let's play a game. I'm not playing a game tonight. We're gone in less than the amount of time we'd be able to finish the game. Uh, but tomorrow we'll be able to play. All right. What are the odds I get just two? Oh, oh, oh. Hey, tradable 85. We'll take that. We will take that, boys. Easy profit. I may catch you if we're early. We'll be live tomorrow throughout new content. And past it by many hours is the plan. That's 16k right there. Easy money. And also, too, one of the reasons why I like being this low in coins right now as well is showing you guys you don't need a lot of coins to do this grind. Um, Can we start doing, uh, Matthew, for these, can we do the, uh, the share screen instead of share play? Could you switch it to a share screen? That way it doesn't kick me out each time. Would that be possible for people doing share play content? Because then it just saves time across the board. Um, unless it's something we're doing like a stat reveal for a player pick and you're wanting me to open it. We should try to stick to the share screen. So if you could switch that to a share screen, buddy, that'd be awesome. Uh, so you open an 83 times two if you're out of fodder, right? I mean, you can use it for fodder. Oh, can only share screen PS5. Really? Never mind then. My apologies. I guess if you can do the share screen, do it, but share play if you can't. All right, ready when you are, buddy. Can I share play another pack? Yep, just be ready to go after this. The second we're done with this, we'll head to yours. So if you want to send the party invite now, um, please do. We'll join right after. All right. Open when you're ready, buddy. Oh, I have control. Oh. Inform. CDM. A whole loop. Mumble, what is a way to make coins easy right now? Gold libs, gold libs, gold libs, gold libs, gold libs. Gold libs. No problem, buddy. Enjoy the fodder. I don't think you guys understand how much profit there is in gold libs. You see the rocket. We're making 400 coins on each one right now. There's like 50 other cards you can do that with. If you don't know what we're talking about, it's in the description. The gold lib method. 
I think he means gold libs. Yeah, I might. The, re the reason I'm so hard on some of you guys about it, or I keep pushing it, is once you've done it, you understand how good it is. And for people who haven't tried it, my goodness. And for investors, looking at the prices right now from what they were, we're looking at double coin territory. We get gold commons with silver upgrade. So where do we get rares from? Multiple different rares. Uh, multiple different ways. One, you can bid on the market and pick them up. Uh, if you put your gold commons into the 83 times 2 section of the gold commons, you'll get a tradable gold rare there. Uh, once you put a um, your silver common... Oh. James. Nice. Um, sorry, where was I at? Yeah, there's two different sections where you can put the uh, gold commons to get yourself tradable rare players, which we just packed a summer, which made us 16K. Um, so now we can use that additional money we just got to buy even more gold rares if we want. You have the 75 times five where you get five untradable gold rares back. That's the majority of the ones you need. Uh, you can always on, bid on the ones you don't have. Um, plenty of different ways. Is investing in gold libs good this weekend? If you understand which players you're investing in and the prices they were and what you think they'll get back to, then yes. All right, we're going to get back to ours after this one, boys. Does that make sense, Muhammad? What is gold lib? A gold Libertadores card, a.k.a. a Libertadores card that is 75 plus rated. A.k.a. in the description, you'll find the gold lib method video if you haven't watched yet. Highly recommend you watch that uh, to get a full understanding of not only the method, but the value in them. Brazil, Anthony. Remember when we lost like 500K on Antony's? And you have them already, Rip. <laughs> as long as I don't get an 86 foot fantasy player, I'm happy. Muhammad, I don't know if you didn't hear us, buddy. We just answered your question. So go back like a minute and stream. We just walked through every single way you could get gold rares. Or not maybe every way. We didn't do everything. We gave you like five different options. All right, we got a Diaby now. Ready to share mine? Oh, why is it kicking us down? Did we already go back to the menus or no? Carlos, let me finish mine up first, buddy. Uh, then we'll do yours. You were mentioned on Facebook the other day. Wait, I, do you have a, can you get a screenshot of it? I'm curious. I've seen on Twitter a couple of times in the last FIFA, people would link my, my uh, unlimited bid video. And I saw that on Twitter quite a bit. All right, we got, we can do five of these a day. Dang. This is going to be a fun week, boys. Look how many commons I'll be able to use in this too. Let's go. This is why the uh, the uh, premium silver upgrade is going to be important as well. Look at that. Beautiful. Which gold lib should I invest in? Broadboy, if you haven't watched our gold lib method trading video, 
to understand the gold lid players, teams, positions that already have high value or you're not familiar with those prices, me giving you a name to invest in wouldn't make any sense because you wouldn't understand why their price is what they are. So I'd recommend doing it first, getting an understanding of a certain player and going from there. Does that make sense? Like I can tell you Pizzini right now because Pizzini was 3K. If he's less than 3K now, you think he can get back to 3K. But if you're not familiar with his ups and downs, you're going to be confused on when to sell. And other thing too is how long you want to hold, right? It might be a week hold. It might be a day. Depends on what content comes on and what affects it. Right now we have nothing in packs. So people wanting to do league SPCs will happen less often. What's up? I haven't been on the streams for months. Was failing my classes. So I was studying. Mumble Elite is not cool. <laughs> well, with a name like that, mate, you obviously must be the smartest student in your class. Hopefully they test one well. All right. We got our 85 plus. We're going to enter Carlos's after we're done with this one. Send me a party invite if you guys haven't already. We'll go through the rest of them. This will be the last thing I do on my account, and then we'll do your guys' stuff. I got eight minutes till I have to go. All right, let me hit pause. This will be our YouTube short for tomorrow. Come on. All right, dudes, we got the 85 plus mixed campaign pack. Come on, EA. Let's get something good. good fodder we'll take the good fodder it's not even great fodder it could have been higher but is what it is he's good I mean, he's never sniffing the field but <laughs> all right carlos is next All right, if you guys haven't sent a share play over or a party invite, send it. We're going to go down the list of who sent party invites. I think I dream of the lib players the way I've been buying and selling Rocket, Pazini, etc. Dude, it... It doesn't make sense how many coins you can make on some of these guys. And like, we're being very conservative the way we're doing it um, on stream with the prices we're doing. So we're still making like 400 per card. If you're getting risky with it, my goodness, the amount of cards you can win for 650 to like a thousand on bid and double, triple your coins on is insane. Oh, oh, Isaac. I'm not happy for you because he's a Newcastle player, but as a usable player, he is a beast. GG, man. That's a huge W. If only he had a Sunderland badge next to his name. Is 75 plus times five good for fodder? Um, depends on how many you do and what you pack, right, mate? If you do one and you don't get anything good, are you going to think it's good? If you do 10 and you pack... An insane walkout. You'll probably be happy with it. Uh, but you have the 83 times 2 as well and the 82 times 20s. So all of them could get you good fodder. Alright, let's save that. We're going to use that as probably the video for tomorrow. Private. Zach. He's 400k. I didn't even realize that. Can you do unlimited bid this FIFA? Yes, you can go unlimited unassigned. We have a video on it. If you put exclamation mark bid in chat. It's through unassigned this year though. It's not through the uh, transfer target. All 
All right, we entered Matthews. Did anyone else send one that we didn't get to? He scored two goals tonight, did he? By the way, Arsenal plays Sunday, boys. I'm hoping for a clean sheet, a Saliba um, masterclass, and an Arsenal win for no particular reason. Oh, he's a pen merchant. He scored a pen in the 93rd minute. Jeez. I could do the icon pack for 100K. There you go. All right, 85 plus, come on. Foot birthday or foot fantasy. Jota. Jota. Odd to get high raid fodder. Open packs. 75 times 5. 83 times 2. 82 times 20. If you're not opening anything, you can't really expect to get fodder, can you? GG. But Arsenal to win and keep a clean sheet. There was a day when I thought we were friends. All right, I want Saliba to get as best as possible of a card. Sue me. That makes me a bad person. All right? Are you doing the crime fast we see? Most likely I will. Most likely. That's the first good thing you've got me since I started watching you during team of the year. <laughs> Some poor souls I've packed the worst things for. Some people I pack Pele, Cruyff, R9, and then others I pack. Not even walkouts. His dribbling is amazing and a really complete player. So the question is, well, first and foremost, I'm doing the... Uh, the 89 plus first. That's where I'm putting my fodder first. We should have it either tomorrow or Sunday. We should have the 89 plus icon. Depending on what we get in the icon determines what we do moving forward. If we get a crap card and not usable, we'll probably go for Cruyff to put at center forward and go from there. Um, then we'll probably do the Zabrata at some point. And then we'll go from there. Do you think the Icon SVC is worth it? Uh, yeah, if you're grinding it, I would say it is. He's like, it's a plus two, right? Uh, he played and he scored twice. So I think that's a guaranteed plus two. Yeah. Are you going to save? Nope. Instead, I'm just going to non-stop open packs so we can build unlimited packs and fodder up until the next promo and then keep doing that through the next promo as well with whatever is out. Keen is my king. All right, let's get down to. Oh, you frauds are going to outbid me right now, are you? All right, I'll do this off stream. 
All right, guys, thank you for chilling today. If you did enjoy the stream, do me a favor before you leave, smack that like button. If you guys could get in the habit of just smacking that like button, uh, whether you enjoy a stream or you want to show support to the channel, every time you come into the stream, click the stream, hit the like button. It's the easiest way that YouTube understands that you guys enjoy the content, that you want to see it more, and that it should recommend it to more people. Uh, that's better than donations. That's better than a million other things you could do when it comes to YouTube's algorithm. So if you guys do enjoy the streams, that's the one thing I will ask you for sure each day is just to smack the like button. But also, if you guys are new, feel free to subscribe, dudes. We have a trading playlist you can take a look at. I'm going to link it in chat right now. Uh, we also have videos in the description you can take a look at. The one I would recommend is the gold lib method. I'll link it in chat right now too. Uh, the gold lib method makes us tons and tons of coins. If you have any questions on it after watching it, feel free to leave the questions on that video. I can respond to them. Uh, and yeah, I will catch you guys tomorrow around new content, dudes. How can I grind and open the most packs? Marco, I'm going to show you that video tomorrow, buddy. That is our upload for tomorrow. So put the notifications on the channel. You will see it then. Take it easy. God bless. Video will be up in like, what time is it? 5.15? like 16 hours 16 hours i'll record it tomorrow morning and then it'll be up before new content